you're welcome to my channel in this tutorial we are told that using the angles of 45 degree and 60 degree set square as basis construct angles 15 degree by bisection to construct angle what 15 degree i'm going to place draw a line this way right and i'm going to call the first point of that line to be point a and the next point should be what point b you can see that now we are constructing 15 degree now we know 15 degree is gotten from the multiple division of what of 60 degree right and i know that this is this set square here has what is called my 60 degree so what i'll do is when it says square is standing in this manner, right? When it's standing, the inclined axis here is what is 60. So I'm going to move it to point A and I'm going to draw an inclined line this way. So this inclined line you are seeing here is 60 degree. What we are told to calculate for what? 15 degree. Now, when I put it this way again, you can see that. When it's lying down this way, this inclined line now is now 30 degree. So if I move it here, this is another 30 degree. We don't need it. Right? Now, if this is 30 and this is 60, don't forget we're moving in an anticlockwise manner. That means this is our basis here. This our line AB is 0 degree on the line, horizontal line. Now, what I will do is... I'll be focusing on my 30 and 0 between these two because I know that if I divide by sec 30 or I divide that into 2, I'll be having 15. So I'm going to take my compass, place it at point A here, right? And I'll draw an arc this way that will bisect the both of them that I'm considering. So where it intersects the horizontal axis, I'll call it A prime. And where it intersects the, the inclined axis, 30 degree inclination, I'll call it a prime prime now i'll place it at a prime here i'm going to strike an arc and i'll place it at a prime prime here i'm going to strike another arc so let's see where they meet is giving us what my point c i will now draw a line passing through point c now since i'm bisecting angle 30 so when it's passing through point c point c to a this way so it means that this is my angle what? My angle 15 degree. So the angle between here and here is giving us what? 15 degree. This is how you construct 15 degree. You can see that? Now, let's now see if we're not told just to use your compass. You repeat the same thing. I will take my set square right i'm going to draw a line this way you can see that i'll call this point point a and point b now what i'll do is from point a i'll just draw an arc any radius the compass should be at any given radius i'll draw an arc this way just see what i'll do from point a i'll draw an arc this way now, where the line, when I do that, I don't need to adjust my compass or leave it the same way the radius it is. Where the line inclined um, cuts my AB, I'll call it A prime, right? With the same radius, this radius I used to draw my arc this way, I'll place it at the point A prime, and I'm going to cut. Where it cuts, this is my arc here, I'll call that point, point C. So if I take my rule, to pass through point C here, that angle I'm going to be getting, to pass through point C here, the angle I'll be getting will be my angle what? 60 degree. This is for the inclined angle 60 degree here. Well, I don't need angle 60 degree. What I need is what? 15 degree. Now what I'll do is I'm going to bisect in between here and here. Don't forget, the one lying down is 0 degree. So by setting between 0 and what? And 60. That will give me what? 30. How will I do that? 
with any given radius i'll place it at a prime i'll strike an arc and at point c here i'm going to strike another arc to cut the first one that will give me point what point d and i'll draw a line that will pass through point d from point a so when i do that i'll be having this this way I'm going to be having this this way and this angle you see here is giving us my angle what angle 30 degree right but i don't need 30 what the equation says that we should buy set what angle what angle um 15 degree right so i'm going to buy set in between when i buy set 30 degree 0 to 30 i'm going to get 15. so what i'll do is where this arc cuts 30 here i'm going to call it point what point a prime prime so I now bisect a prime with any given radius and a prime prime so where they meet will be the half of 30 and that is 15 degrees so i'm going to what i'm going to take in that point so that angle will be my angle what my angle 15 degree you see the difference this is using your compass this is using your compass and your set square and this is also only using what your compass to construct so exactly. if you found this video helpful please don't forget to subscribe like and share the video thanks for watching